There's going to be a display of drawings done mm -hmm. by all the people that use the library. Well, anybody who uses the library and likes to draw. Yeah, and each drawing's supposed to be a picture of the artist's favorite musical memory. Yeah. All the pictures will be pinned up on the wall and will be part of the Willow Avenue Public Library Display of Musical Memory. Yeah, and Hall, we're, we're all, all going, going to do drawings. drawings. Well, that sounds like a terrific idea. Hmm. So I guess it's going to be art, paper, and paints all over the place, uh -huh. is it? Yep. Sure, Holly, why don't you do a drawing, too? Yeah, why don't you? You're an artist. And you love music, so you'll have a lot of musical memories. Yep. Well, it, it sounds like fun. But I tell you what, I, I really should finish the letter I was starting when you came in. Why don't you three go ahead and get set up, and I'll join you as soon as I'm finished here. Okay, okay. Hall! Yeah. Come on, let's start those musical memories humming! Okay! Yay. My goodness, you all look so industrious. What's industrious, Holly? Means hard working, Gloria. Jacob, how did you know that? Because we Blue Jays are very industrious. Ah, smart, too. Jacob, you seem to be working twice as fast as anyone else. What's the big rush? Well, you see, Hall, I couldn't make up my mind which was, was my most favoritest musical memory. So I'm going to draw two. Oh, and <laughs> what's this one you're working on now? Well, that's our porch party. Yeah. <gasps> Picture it, Hall. All the gang was there, and we had a puppet show, and trick flying, and most of all, we had really great music. Well, we were sitting on the front porch with some of our friends, soaking up the sunshine when somebody said it sure would be fun to have a little party, and then I got excited. They said I was invited, and I could bring the gang along. So now we're rocking on the old front porch. We're rocking on the old front porch. Rocking on the old front porch. Rocking on the old front porch. Kick up your shoes, kick up your heels, cause we're rocking on the old front porch. Keep going on. I looked out and it made me feel good to see the whole neighborhood. There was Mrs. McMurphy, Chuck Chicken, Mitzi and Kel, Calvin, and the street. Yay. There was soda pop and the dancing was free. People were bopping so fancy free. Everybody was jumping, having a ball. They were dancing on the lawn. They were dancing on the wall. The band was rocking and rolling all day. Dancing the old blues of the way. So now we're rocking on the old front porch. Rocking on the old front porch. Yeah, rocking on the old front porch. Rocking on the old front porch. Everybody, kick up your shoes. Kick up your heels and rock it on the old front porch. Yeah, that's a good one, Jake. Of course, mine is pretty nice, too. Well, let's see your picture. Yeah, maybe. okay, okay, sure. Have a look. Oh, what do you think? Oh, well, so nice. um, what is it, Egg? I think it's upside down. No, it's not. Oh, uh, well, well, now, wait a minute, wait a minute. I see. It's, uh, it's a green creature from outer space eating a pineapple. Holly. I think you've missed what I'm trying to portray. Are you sure it isn't upside down? Gloria, it's supposed to be a picture of my close personal friend, world-famous lizard superstar, E. Lizard Beth Taylor. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Remember when she came to visit us? Wasn't it great? Yeah, you got pretty excited, Egg. Yeah. You thought that being a movie star was really exciting. I did, yeah. Like some million laughs when you're a movie star. Signing autographs and eating caviar. You can see her photograph, movie magazine. Splashing in her bubble bath, feeling like a queen. Life's a holiday when you're a movie star. Really? Parties night and day, noise and loud guitar. Wow! You while your time away on the telephone 
Eating tons of ice cream cones. Ooh. Not only that. Why, well, tell me, tell me. You never have to work. A maid does all the chores. You eat the finest foods that money can afford. You never wait in line at the grocery store. People know your face when you walk in through the door. You got it? Yeah. It's all fun and games when you're a movie star. Fortune fans and fame and riding fancy cars. That's right. You've got a million friends and pen pals by the score. Darling, who could ask for? Darling, who could ask for? Darling, who could ask for more? Oh, that was a great song. Yeah. And a great musical memory, Yig. Thanks. Perhaps Iggy will be a famous artist one day. <laughs> oh, uh, perhaps you will all be famous artists uh -huh. one day. Thank you, yeah, thank you Holly. Mm -hmm. uh, so, Gloria, what did you do for your musical memory? Well, this is a drawing of when our friend Jess came to the apartment and modeled all the different outfits for your book about jobs. And you told us that anyone can try to do any job that they want. You can be who you want to be. You can do what you want to do. So who do you want to be when you grow up? Just between me and you. Let's pretend just a little bit. Pick a job you'll be happy with. And what do you want to do when you grow up? Oh, it's all up to you. Jacob, what about you? I like to fly up in the sky above the clouds so very high. So I could be a captain of a plane. Hey, great. I like to travel everywhere. Feel the wind blow through my hair. So maybe someday I could drive a train. Gloria, I like to help my friends get better when they're sick or when it hurts. So I could be a doctor or a nurse. What about you, Jeff? I love to play and make believe. I love to sing, I love to read. And I'm not searching, it's just what I'll do. It doesn't matter what you choose to do. As long as it's important to you. A plumber or a lifeguard or a keeper at the zoo. A teacher or a baker or a firefighter too. Holly. You can be who you want to be. You can do what you want to do. So who do you want to be when you grow up? Just between me and you. Let's pretend just a little bit. Pick a job you'll be happy with. So what do you want to do when you grow up? It's all up to you. Very nice, Gloria. Your picture almost sings. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, what about you, Holly? You've been busy. Which memory did you choose? Yeah, I bet you had trouble deciding two, Hall. Uh -huh. Did you choose one, or are you going to have to do two pictures like me? It was a tough decision. You know, I think I have different favorites on different days, depending on what mood I'm in. I think a lot of people are like that. Oh, well, so what kind of a mood are you in today, Hall? This kind of a mood. Oh, Holly, that's nice. I know what that musical memory is. It's the day Holly learned to skate. It's no fun sitting back and wishing while the skaters glide on by. So step into a new tradition and let your spirit fly. Slip, slide, tumble and turn and kick your heels up high. Cause you're never too old to learn And it's never too late to try Hey, look at me I'm spinning round and round I can go wherever I please And never once fall down and free. I can skate from end to end. But if you can't make it the very first time, just pick yourself up and, and try, try it again. again. Try, 
try it again, again and again and again. Christmas is a time of magic. It's a special holiday. Some put up a holly wreath. Some go riding in a one-horse sleigh. Just be true to your traditions. Don't let winter pass you by. Cause you're never too old to learn. And it's never too late. Never too late. Never too late to try. I did it! I skated! Wow! The nice thing about a musical memory is that it can always bring back a good time. Mm -hmm. In a way, the thing you're remembering is never really finished. Huh. Jacob, that was fast. Let's see. Hmm. Whoa, mm -hmm. hey, Jake, that's really good. Jacob, I think this is some of your best work. Well, that's because it's one of my best memories, Hall. Why? Because, Gloria, this is all about Halloween. Welcome to our lovely home on Halloween. Halloween. A haunted house where goblins roam on Halloween. Halloween. Tonight's the night for tricks and treats. And scaring people off their feet. With every spook you'll ever want to meet. Walking down the street. Who's that knocking on your door on Halloween? Halloween. Let us in and find out more on Halloween. Halloween, Halloween, tonight's the night we waited for. Other nights are such a bore. Open up and find out what's in store. Rotten to the core, I'll bring my creation, a special friend of mine. But maybe I should mention that his name is Frankenstein. I'll fly out at midnight upon my witch's broom. And if you're not in bed by then, I'll send some ghosts and goblins to your room. proud of the artwork you've all done. Yeah. Thank you. And you know what else? What? Well, what? If my memory serves me correctly, I think that there's just about enough time before dinner to get these down to the library. Oh, oh. I can't wait to show Ms. Filcher. Yeah. Me too. Me three. Okay, well, come on. Let's get the tops on the paint all and right. wash out the brushes. And, uh, yeah. oh, go ahead. Maybe okay, wash my brush. My portfolio. All right, I will. Hey. Let's see if dry enough to put Why don't on. you draw a picture of one of your favorite songs? Yeah. It'll be fun. Huh. Bye. Thank you. 